Hi there, welcome to this tutorial on using Windows 8 internet connection inside a Hyper-V virtual machine. My name is William and I'm excited to share with you my experience that I went through after installing a virtual machine on my laptop. As a systems developer, I prefer to leverage tools whenever possible. And I can clearly tell you, I was excited and ecstatic to hear about the Hyper-V support in Windows 8 Professional. And I can clearly tell you, it's by far one of my most exciting features. Traditionally, I used to use VirtualBox to separate my client development environment. Dedicating a virtual machine to each environment keeps my machine clean and reduces the overheads of all apps. After some research, try and error, I was able to figure it out and configure Hyper-V to use my machine's internet connection. I thought it would be helpful to document the process as a way to help others looking for the same information. Now, uh, the first step we have to do is to launch our uh, Hyper-V Virtual Machine Manager. Uh, there we go. Now, I forgot to mention, you must make sure that your virtual machine is not running. It should be off. Okay, if you ensure that, uh, on the right hand side, on the Actions pane, click Virtual switch manager when the virtual switch manager opens on the left hand side make sure you click the new virtual switch new virtual network switch and then the right hand side make sure you select internal and click create virtual switch you can name it any name you want uh, I'll, in this instance i'll name it the network you can name it anything you want and then create uh, apply uh, in Windows 8 system tray on our wireless icon you can see an identified network click uh, right click and open network sharing center now you can see that we have a uh, a v network created back in hyper v select your virtual machine and click settings select a legacy network adapter click add in the adapter details select uh, the adapter that we configured recently in, let me check it out select uh, the same adapter that we configured recently here it is the v network and click apply click ok now let's go back to our network sharing center uh, click change adapter details now here you must select the network that you need to share with your virtual machine right click and select properties click on sharing and enable click these check boxes two check boxes and on the home networking connection on the drop down list select the network that we configured in this case is this v network and click ok and there we have it. Now you can close this window, go back to uh, uh, our virtual machine. Uh, now we can test and see if our network is working for the machine. Let's start the server. So take a while, I'll run it faster.
as you can see uh, our machine is connected to the internet we can go on and test it on internet sprawler so for google there we go I hope this has been informative and I would like to thank you for watching.